Hello, this is the game number six against Jack Sabis. I played e4, c5, d4, knight at frame. In, it's interesting now e5, but uh, it's not so strong because it's clear that if I take the pawn, I lose the knight for check on e5, double attack. But I can simply play c3, I sacrifice a pawn, and I play to attack uh, this diagonal. Uh, very weak after e5, so it's dangerous for black playing this way. Um, after knight f3, black played knight c6 is correct. I played, I took the pawn, d6, knight c3, a6, and bishop e3. e6, queen d2, castle, long, f3. Bishop e7, g4, and b5. b5 is correct, the black idea should be make uh, pressure against the queen side, so. Uh, is correct this strategy g5 and knight d7 h4 I attack the king side with the pawns and now the threat could be the knight and the three at the same time the knight can go on c4 knight d5 is interesting I played bishop e2 to defend f a f3 and that will load f4 knight c4 and now I think it's good to take the bishop the knight b takes and f4. My idea is uh, break the enemy position on f5, bishop b7, and f5. Knight takes, queen takes, e5. Knight e5 is interesting because the black can take the queen. If he takes, I take the queen with a check. And after, for example, king d7, I can simply take the rook, and if he takes the bishop, I can go out with the knight with knight b6 check so for me it's very good this position I take an exchange probably yeah I take an exchange so queen d4 bishop takes d5 queen takes d5 and castle long queen takes f7 yeah it's wrong because I can simply take the pawn the black now has to play probably um, rook c8 uh, Simply, the rook is under attack, so the black can try to move rook c8 to defend the pawn on c4 better and to try to push on c3 ladder. Uh, castle, I simply take the pawn and after c3, I check, check again, and probably. And again, this end game that should be one for me, but now I play it down so well. And after rook d3, rook c4, the black has a strong counter attack. Probably in this position I made a mistake because in this position in which the black king is very bad, the trade the queen was not a very strong idea for me. And now probably I should play b takes e3. And uh, it was better because if now the black trade the queens, I will have a, a good pawn structure. So then the game would be completely win for me. So my move b takes e uh, my move uh, queen takes b7 was a clearly a mistake for me because the black has a bad king, so uh, if the black doesn't trade the queen, uh, I can attack uh, well, so yeah, this is, was an important mistake. Uh, queen takes b7, because now it's not so easy win this end game after rook c4. Rook f1, I fought to push on f6 to have a counter attack, and rook takes f, rook takes d6. I think if the black now play well, should be a draw. King d2. Okay, now for me it's not a good idea to take the bishop because it should be easier uh, for black to find a draw without the bishop. So I played king d3, rook a4, and check. After king d5, I played c4. They, with the simple idea to trade my doublet pawn on c3 for the good pawn on a6 of black. So I take the pawn a6, e4, I go back on e2, bishop b4. King d1. Rook c3, I play bishop d2, and after rook c4, I trade. Mm, was better, probably rook a4 to make pressure and to try to trade all the pieces. So now I missed this move. Yeah, I was stronger. Probably it's better for me to try to trade the rooks. I trade the bishops now, and I play king d2, rook d4. I tried to play the active king, king d2, and now rook a3. Now this in the game is completely draw. 
I tried to play this move, and now the only move for black is playing the A file because this game is draw if there are the rooks in the game. But after king c5, the black lose immediately for rook c3. I trade the rooks, and the opponent game is completely uh, one for white. So if king a4 or king a5, this uh, this uh, position should be a draw. Very hard to win for white this. So after king c5, rook c3, you try tries e3 check. I play simply king d3. The black has to trade, and now the black lost. Okay, I think it's not so important to go forward with end game because we know this is very easy to win two pawns against the king.